Welcome all of you sauce and gravy lovers out there. This is Johnny Mac with the Sauce and Gravy channel. Are you ready for a super easy to make topping sauce for breakfast or desserts? Then let me quickly show you how to make a hot fudge chocolate sauce. Buckle up, let's go. Shall we begin with some light prep work? Whip out your trusty blade and get choppy choppy on five ounces, that's 141 grams of bittersweet chocolate. 60% cacao, that's slightly over one bar of chocolate. So that's all there is to it, not too bad, right? Toss those chocolate chunks into a mixing bowl that can withstand heat, and you'll see why in a second. Round up your remaining four ingredients, there's not really that much to it, in a sauce pot, put it over medium heat, pour in half of a cup, 125 milliliters of heavy cream. Warm up that cream, get it nice and hot until it just starts to bubble. And then you'll pour that heavy cream ever so carefully over those chocolate chunks. Try to submerge those chunks in it. Put your bowl to the side, let those chocolate chunks have a nappy nap in that hot cream so that they can melt and hopefully incorporate into that cream. After about two to three minutes, break out that spatula and go to town on that heavy cream and chocolate. Mix it until it's nice and smooth. This is such a versatile chocolate fudge. You could throw it on breakfast items like waffles, pancakes, crepes, French toast. Throw it on desserts, ice cream, cheesecakes, regular cakes, dip fruit in it. Heck, you could drink it. Your options, well, they're endless. Sometimes things just don't go as planned. After endlessly mixing, getting a kitchen workout, the chocolate chunks, they just refuse to melt. So what do you do? A microwave or a hot water bath? That's why you need to put the chocolate chunks into a bowl that can be heated up, maybe in the microwave or a hot water bath. Heat up a small amount of water in the sauce pot, plop that mixing bowl on top, grab your spatula, mix away until that chocolate fudge is nice and smooth. Even if the chocolate doesn't melt right off the bat, this still is a sauce or a fudge that you can make in a matter of minutes. After a quick warm up and a mix, the fudge is ready to go. Now it's time for you to add a few last ingredients and then you can indulge. First add one tablespoon or eight grams of powdered sugar. Then you'll add a quarter of a teaspoon of cayenne pepper. And if you've never tried this in chocolate, you've got to. For your last ingredient, one teaspoon of vanilla. Drop it in. Mix everything together and then you're ready to dive in. If for some reason you don't eat it all in one serving, which you probably will, you can pop it into the fridge, take it out, throw it in the microwave, or put it into a warm water bath, and then gobble it all up. Thanks Sauce and Gravy Nation for watching and all of your kind support. If you liked this video and found it helpful, smash that like button. And if you're not part of the community just quite yet, what are you waiting for? Hit that subscribe button and stay tuned to the latest and greatest sauce making tips and techniques. Thanks again for watching and keep whisking y'all.